Using Catcher, the Structure Editor integrated into Commotion to create chemical compounds can prove challenging, especially when dealing with inorganic compounds, complexes, or polymers. Therefore, the video is titled Salts and Chemical Elements, Ligands and Complexes, and Polymers provide general advice and tricks to help you create these compounds. In this video, you will learn about practical hotkeys which facilitate the drawing and creation of chemical compounds in Catcher. As an example, we will create the molecule ethane. There are various useful hotkeys, such as the combination Control Z and Control Y, which undo and redo the last changes, respectively. The commands plus and minus zoom in and out of the editing window. They also center the drawing automatically. Please note that it is essential to only press plus or minus. In contrast, control plus or control minus adjust the entire screen display instead of just the editing window. The escape key deselects the parts of the structure that have previously been marked as selected. The delete key removes selected objects from the structure. You can switch between all bond types by pressing 1. Pressing 5 allows you to switch between the two charges. To insert an atom from the right hand toolbar, you can simply use the respective letters. For example, after selecting a specific atom in the drawn structure, in this case a carbon atom, press the N key to transform it into a nitrogen atom. Pressing H will turn it into a hydrogen atom. Pressing O will turn it into an oxygen atom, and so on. To insert chlorine and bromine, use the combinations Shift C and Shift B, respectively. Pressing these keys without selecting any atoms from the drawn structure inserts the corresponding chemical element in combination with the number of hydrogen atoms matching their valence into the drawing area. Switch the choice of standard aromatic compounds and cycloalkanes by pressing T. To apply the cleanup function to the entire drawing area, press Control L. To view additional hotkeys, hover the mouse above the various tool icons. Finally, use this additional trick to switch between different bond types. Single bonds are usually set as the default. However, by repeatedly clicking on a chemical bond, you can alter it between single, double, or triple bonds. To access any other required bond types, you will have to use the menu on the left.